Checking some health news now, a third case of HIV has been cured. This according to scientists. The news bringing more awareness to the disease as many wonder what it means for the medical community and beyond. Eric Cost has more. All three cases were cured using the same method, a stem cell transplant. The donors all carrying one rare mutation, essentially blocking the HIV virus from entering cells. A couple of years into that treatment, they stopped HIV medications, and these three patients then had no further detectable HIV virus in their blood. Exciting news worldwide, but Dr. Anya Butler says it's not the whole picture. The treatment is only for those with severe cancer and can be life-threatening. It's not, not going to be available for everybody because these patients now trade their HIV medications for arguably much more toxic chemotherapy medications. So while it's not the cure, Dr. Butler says the good news is we've still made incredible progress in treating HIV. Well, the life expectancy is almost close to normal. The treatment with the medication has made such great progress. If anything, she hopes this news brings awareness to prevention in a time where many are focused on another infectious disease. It's a great story of collaboration between oncologists, infectious disease physicians. We have talked the last two years exclusively about COVID. Um, and we have to remember that there are other infectious diseases out there. Reporting, Eric Cost, News 8. All right, Ericetta, thank you. 50% of known HIV cases are women, but only 11% partake in clinical trials for a cure. Dr. Butler says the medical community is working on diversifying the pool of participants.